Adam and Corwin are playing games. They're both so stupid and lame. The show is going to hell. In a handbasket. Hey there, interwebs. I'm Adam. That's Corwin. This is Handbasket Gaming, and today we are playing Back to the Future, the NES game. It's not good. It's, it's not even remotely good. This was from a string of games from a company called LJN, which... Any bad, like, movie or TV show game that you played for a large section of time was made by LJN. And nice. they, oh, oh, yep, oh, oh, yep, yep. come on, Marty McFly. Yeah. So, yeah, this is Marty. Marty looks like no, a street she, Whoa. Damn it. Oh, um, he's just. Dwyer. So what you need to do is you're, you're currently running through the streets of Hill Valley and you need to make it to... Oh! And these guys have what, a... What are they doing? That's a... Oh, shit. A piece of uh, glass. Like, it's a, a sheet of... Uh, oh. Sheet of glass. A pane of glass. A whatever. A thing. And a what's fuck that, you, Biff! What's that transvestite doing over there? That's uh, doing the hula, I think. Okay. Oh, that's a hula hoop. Oh, I've played this a number of times, and I never realized that was a hula hoop. Ah, fuck you, B! Those are bees. Bees. Fuck you, B. So the whole point here is that you're running through the streets of Hill Valley, and you have to get... You have to pick up clocks, and not to get keep... stung by. Uh, yeah, you have to uh, avoid being... as many things as you can and pick up as many clocks as you can, so you don't run out of time. Down at the bottom, that little picture there. It. Yeah. That's the picture from the movie that fades away uh, as okay. like you know the possible future is bad. <laughs> <laughs> the possible future is bad. It's pretty bad. Yeah. So yeah, at least for the uh, for the get go at the beginning here, it's just this. Oh crap! Oh, I have more than one of those. Balls! You I have, have more than one of those balls. balls. Yes, he do. Yes, he do. So, yeah. And you just... It's its not good. Like, it's not fun to play. It doesn't look it fun. It controls shitty. The graphics are... Like, even for NES graphics... Like, I've seen... There have been good things done with NES graphics. This is decidedly not one of them. This, I, this is kind of a bad thing to just bring up in the middle of an episode. I'm looking at all the... The graphics of this game specifically remind me of a racing game I played when I was a little kid. Yeah. Well, I need to find out what that game was because I now I've got this nostalgia thing where I'm just like, oh man, I want to know what that game RC was. RC Pro-Am? It could be. I got to see a picture of it. It's all visual memory. Okay. Because me. that's back when I couldn't read, so names didn't mean anything to me. I just knew what game it was by the picture. Okay. But yeah, RC Pro-Am was an amazing game. Uh, unlike this game, which is terrible. And fucking bees! bees. Damn it, Oprah! <laughs> oh no, oh no, don't get the skateboard. Because the skateboard makes you go fast, but the skateboard makes you hit things. Like, it makes it, it impossible to control you, and you just, you die. You just, you die. Just, Fuck the just, skateboard, man. Yeah, I, I might. Just put your dick right in it. What part of a, like, is there a knot hole? Is this like a, uh, no, a very rough skateboard, man. I'm not sure oh, how no. you're doing it. Who is the fat guy, and how do you step over that crack without breaking your mom's back? Uh, well, my mom is... Only like sixteen in this. So is this before or after you bang your Oh no, 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 no. Oh Oh look at you! Look at you, you're so good! You're so good. Damn it, B. Oh fucking B. I actually may have stayed alive on that to make it like worth the while. Oh god. And you can't anticipate because what the bees are gonna do? I I assume that no, they they travel in a kind of pattern, but it's not. I assume it's not random each time. But having the know, patience to play this enough times to memorize it, just like you have to be a child and have it. Have this be your only this game shit everywhere. Yeah, I know. Like terrible. Like, this is a very poorly taken care of place. Well, I guess back in the fifties, like cars just you know leaked like sieves. It's just like Damn. just fucking oil everywhere. But the oil is on the sidewalk. Yeah, well, they weren't. They're were all drinking at the time too. There weren't laws against that. There weren't laws against drinking and dr I'm. I, well, I, I don't think, know I enough about stars. Much lighter. Here's where I'm getting all of this knowledge from a documentary about that time frame called. Um, <coughs> whoa, called Mad Men. And there's there's a seven documentary of Mad Men of this uh, show. Yeah. Of uh, documentary, and um, I've watched all of them. Seven seasons of a documentary. That's what you yeah. usually hear when you're talking about documentaries. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, no, that, that, it showed me a lot of things they did back then. Like, there's a scene where the family goes out for a family picnic. 
and they all have like McDonald's or something because that's what you eat in a family picnic. Uh huh. That's what and, I do. And um, okay, that's just a troll. Did you see the, the skateboard right troll. against the thing that you <laughs> run into with the skateboard? Like that would be impossible. Literally mm-hmm. impossible. But like they they have the picnic and they have all the garbage like from the picnic. Yeah. They just, no. They just stand up and dump the. Uh, oh. Fuck. You got shot by some sort of a hornet from that. Uh, from that hula hoop girl. Yeah. Uh, no. Shit. No. 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 Yay. <laughs> but um. 19 seconds left. I had. 19. Nice. <sighs> but anyway, they, but they like yeah. they, they get up and they shake off the blanket and dump that garbage all over this park, this really nice green park they're eating in, and then they just get up and leave. Yeah. And I was just, uh, watching that. I'm always fascinated with that. I'm like, that's just how they do it. That's that's just how they did back then. So this part. I played this game with cheat codes. Like, I used the game genie when I was playing this game. Shit! I played the this game with the game genie so that, like, when I get turned into a cow on the glass over there, it doesn't uh, actually kill me, kill me. Um, so that I didn't run out of... Uh, run out of lives. I have never beaten that first section. Because you go through the streets, and that is somewhat doable. I forgot you could jump. I don't know if that actually gains you anything. Maybe you can jump over ah! uh, the trash cans and stuff. Ah! Ah! Don't let those little Italian men get you. He threw a thing at me. Like, they've got the flattest of flat tops, by the way. Try, try to jump over... There you go. I don't want to experiment, because I did this with only 19 seconds to spare last time. But anyway. That's fair. I... Uh, yeah, never beaten Lou's Cafe, because depth perception on the NES, when those guys are coming at you... Doesn't is, exist. Yeah. And, not to mention, you have to get something like a hundred of them, and if a you miss hundred. a single one, you die. And it's a, it's just over. So, the this, this playthrough of Back to the Future is going to consist of, like, Escape I'm going board? to see... Fuck. I'm going to see how far I can get in the span of... An episode. Uh, either an episode or the four lives that I have. Like, see if I can set a new personal record or something. Mind you, last time I got three, and it's possible that's my personal record, because I haven't played <laughs> this as an adult. So, back when I was a kid, this was just imp- completely impossible, as opposed to just kind of impossible. Good shot. Yeah. Fuck. Oh, no! Good job. Fuck that guy. Got that guy. Thanks. Just so you know. <laughs> bees! Are you just throwing bees at them? No, That's I'm throwing like. milkshakes. Milkshakes? To keep them appeased. Diabetes! Yeah, diabetes! Okay. I'm starting to get the... You're doing better. Starting to get the, the strats. Maybe as an adult, you're just better at it. Nope, that was down one. Oh! That was pimp. Instant replay that. Nope, that was down one. I will. No! Don't instant replay this. You can... Like, ow. 16. 16. I think you have to hit 100 or something. Stupid, stupid, stupidy like that. Ouch. They threw threw you out in a hurry. Thanks. Dick, asshole dick guy. Dick balls. Jerk. Mans. Wee! And I'm back in the streets. I want to see a Breakfast Club Living game on the streets. from NES. I would, I would play the hell out of a Breakfast Club game. Like Breakfast you have Club to game is just run like and avoid the principal and uh, talk learn, about your feelings. Yeah, exactly. H- hit A to uh, to learn about your feelings and uh, B hey, B hey, just hey, expresses hey, angst. Hey, dude, dude. Ooh. I love the <sighs> shit out of that movie as a kid. I still do as an adult. What am I talking about? That movie's great. Yeah, I love that movie. That's great. Judd Nelson. Oh man! I don't know why I just Fucking said John Nelson as opposed. What? I, that's a line from. Um, ah! I think it's it's from one of the. I'm not even sure which one, but it's a movie with Silent Bob and uh, um, Jay and uh, Jane Silent Bob yeah. Strike Back because Judd. Because uh, he's just like Judd Nelson's fucking harsh. Yeah, Judd Nelson is in that movie. Okay, that is what it is. He plays the uh, not the wildlife marshal, but the sheriff guy. Okay. Yeah. Because, yeah, he's, uh... Because I remember that movie, uh, Jenny Tyler Bob Strikes Back, came out around the time that, uh... 
Grand Theft Auto 3 came out because we, me and my friends would have sleepovers all the time. Oh, that was the play. Super Shake. I forgot that was a thing. A Super Shake? Oh, you can just keep throwing them. Just, just lay it out. Lay them out, man. Okay, this might be a good strategy. This might not be. Oh, no, you can only have two on screen at a time. Or three. You're getting a lot of double hits, man. You're doing good. They're getting faster. They're getting faster, but you're also like, you're like a typewriter of milk-shaped death. <laughs> this is obviously the furthest I've gotten now! Oh, his top is so flat. His top was too flat. You couldn't have escaped. His 22. Top was so flat. Okay. 22. I'm out. Electric boogaloo. I've got, I've got one more life, but I don't care because I can't. Just screw this game. This game is terrible. Game. Never playing it again uh, unless somebody asks for it because we will always do that. We will we'll always take requests. We'll be gr gr yeah, we'll be do very it. grumpy about it. Anyway, what do you think is our favorite? Not favorite. I'm sorry. What do you think is our spirit animals? Yeah. Uh, if we had to pick our own spirit animals, what do you think they would be? What if a spirit animal chose us? What do you think chose us? Answer it down below. Uh, we'll record the right answers and give shout outs to people who get it right. Uh, give us suggestions for games that you want to see us play. Even if it is a game we've already played, we'll revisit stuff, whatever. Uh, we'll like, comment, subscribe, whatever. Bye, everybody. Keep it real.